Hi, I'm Emma and I'm here to give you an insight to our A-level drama course at HNC. Here today, we're going to be looking at the relationship between the voice and the actor. We're going to be exploring all the different ways we can say things and why that matters um, in terms of our unique selling point as actors in terms of interpretation. I'm really excited today to be joined by some of our alumni and current students. We've got Poppy, Joseph and Ruby. I'm really excited to show you what we can do with voice and link it to some of our assessment objectives, which is communicating meaning to an audience and refining our theatrical skills as well. We're going to start with the students demonstrating the same phrase but in multiple different ways in terms of communicating loads of different emotions. We're going to see what happens to the voice when it's fueled with different uh, emotions in that space. Oh, hi, I didn't know you were coming. Hi, I did not know you were coming. Hi, I didn't know you were coming. Yeah, I didn't know you were coming. Hey, didn't know you were coming. Hi, I didn't know you were coming. Oh, I didn't know you were coming here. Hi, I didn't know you were coming. <laughs> I didn't know you were coming. Oh my God, I did not know you were coming. I did not know you were coming. I didn't know you were coming. I didn't know you were coming. Well, I didn't know you were coming. So that was excellent. How many different ways did we see um, to communicate meaning there using the same phrase? So well done to the students. Now we're going to move on to a little bit more script analysis. In terms of page to stage, we're going to have a look at what we can do with real text and living something that exists already, that we can manipulate the meaning using just voice. So I'm excited to see what the students do. Next, as we move on after the students' natural portrayal, I'm going to come in and mix it up a little bit with some different emotions on a card. I'm going to show the students the card and we're going to see if we can see a real difference in their portrayals after they read the new emotion that's on the card. Let's see what they do. I'm not angry. I'm not angry at all, actually. You might think I would be angry, but I'm not. You see, I've taught myself how not to be angry. Anger is a kind of fear, and fear is the worst thing. So I've taught myself not to be afraid of anything. My mother used to be afraid of birds. She pretends not to be, but she is. I mean, can you imagine being afraid of birds? I can't. That was excellent, Ruby, well done. Um, now I'm going to offer you one of the emotion cards and see how your portrayal changes. Is that okay? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not angry. I'm not angry at all, actually. <laughs> you might think I would be, but <laughs> I'm not. You see, I've taught myself how not to be angry. Anger is a kind of fear, and fear is the worst thing, so I've taught myself not to be afraid of anything. My mother, <laughs> my mother's afraid of birds. Can you imagine being afraid of birds? I can't. And within my soul there doth conduce a fight of this strange nature, that a thing inseparate divides far wider than the sky and earth. And yet the spacious breadth of this division admits no or effects for a point as Arachne's broken woof to enter. Instance, oh instance, Cressid is mine, tied with the bonds of heaven. Yes. Well done, Joe. Well done, that was really, really good. Yeah, calm down. Yeah, You're yeah. angry. Are you feeling the anger? No, I'm feeling good. I'm going to um, offer you one of the emotion cards yeah. now and see if that majorly changes your portrayal using yeah. these emotions. Cool. All right? Yep. Got it? Right. 
and within my soul. There doth conduce a fight of this strange nature that a thing in separate divides far wider than the sky and earth. <laughs> and yet the spacious breadth of this division, it admits no, a point of no effect as Arachne's broken woof to enter. Instance, oh instance, Cressid is mine tied with the bonds of heaven. You know that when the jury come back that quick, someone is not guilty. The defence team are all shaking hands with Julian. Julian is thrilled. A roar from his boys up in the gallery is loud and, and there is clapping. Well done. I didn't know I didn't want to come in, but do you know if you finished? Well done. Um, I'm going to offer you one of the emotion cards now and see if that majorly changes what you do emotionally. Okay, I've got it. Yeah. You know that when the jury come back that quick, someone is not guilty. The defence team are all shaking hands with Julian. Julian is thrilled. A roar from his boys up in the gallery is loud and, and there is clapping. Well done to the students, that was excellent. And I saw real differences between the meaning that was conveyed based on what was on the cards. So for those of you watching at home and you were wondering, the emotions that are on the cards are laughter, infatuation and anger. So Poppy had the new emotion of anger to explore and Ruby had laughter and Joe had infatuation. So well done to them. Thank you so much for watching and please try some of these exercises at home in preparation for the course.